Hello, I'm Melanie Maserant, one of Springer Nature's Account Development Managers. I'm here to show you how to navigate nature.com, home to nature-branded research and review journals. I also work closely with your licensing manager, Christina Sontag. My goal is to help you learn how to find the research you need when you need it. I will cover the platform's features, basic and advanced search functions, and how to register for a free account. Let's begin at nature.com. The home page includes top stories from across nature. Scroll down to see additional features such as news and comment, latest reviews and analysis, latest research, collections, and trending. This is where you can learn about today's most popular articles that are being shared, liked, and talked about online. Altmetric tracks article citations, social media shares, and mentions in blogs and news outlets. If you want to read the most current issue of Nature, just scroll back up to the top and click on the journal cover. Here we are, we're in the most current issue of Nature. Nature.com is also built with web responsive design, so content is automatically optimized for viewing on all mobile devices. As you can see, Nature's homepage is loaded with news, but the buttons you need most are menu, and search. The search button searches all nature journals across nature.com. I'll search uh, biotechnology as an example. By default, results are sorted by relevance, but you can filter the results sort by most recent and oldest. Over to the left, you can add additional features like article type, journal, and date. The result box on the right links to the latest news in biotechnology. It also features links to related subject areas. By selecting Browse All Subjects, you can see a full list that fall under Biological Sciences. Let's go back to filtering our search. Okay, let's try something new. I'm going to try the term biosensors. To filter this search, I'm going to look at the different uh, article types. In this drop down, you can see we have research, news, correspondence, among others. Let's go with research. Next, I want to select a journal, and I want Nature Biotechnology. I want to sort by date. Let's go with last year. And I also want to change the sort by relevance to the most recent. OK, here's our results. Let's select the first one. Here we are, we're in Nature Biotechnology. You can navigate this article by either scrolling down or selecting the sections, figures, and reference tab on the right side. You can also download the PDF. And check out the article's metrics. Speaking of metrics, the platform captures article level metrics which are quantitative and qualitative indicators of the impact that an article has had. Some examples include download statistics, links from mainstream social media sources, and social media shares. Let's move on to advanced searching. Before we do this, we need to get back to the home page. 
To help you easily navigate your research journey, nature.com has a breadcrumb trail to take you back to any place. Just click nature at the top of the banner to get back to the home page. And here we are. And how about we do another search? By default, any search you enter will search across all of nature.com. However, if you select advanced search, you can search a topic within a journal and filter your results by date. Let's try one. How about cancer treatment? I'm also going to enter a term in the where the title contains field. How about immune therapy? And let's filter our results by publication date of the last two years. And finally, let's decide which journal we want to search in. I'm going to enter cancer to see what we get in the drop down. All right, here's our options. Let's go with nature cancer. Okay, here's our results. Let's go with the first one. Okay, here we are. We're in Nature Cancer. Like I showed you before, you can navigate this article by either scrolling down or using the sections, figures, or reference tabs on the right side. Next, I'll show you the A to Z index. This feature is useful if you want to see a list of specific journals. Just click on Menu and go down to View All Journals. Okay, here's our A to Z index. Let's go to N and find Nature Biotechnology. Here we are. And Nature Cancer, the journals we used for previous searches. Before I conclude this training, I'll show you how to register for a free account. This way, you're getting the best results from nature.com. To register for a free account, you can either log in here at this icon, or you can go back to the home page. Let's do that. Select login, and then register now. Fill out your contact information and agree to the terms and conditions. Once you have an account, you'll be able to sign up for news alerts and track journals and topics that are important to you. I hope you found this training to be useful. Our goal at Springer Nature is to help researchers advance discovery by making their findings as accessible, discoverable, and shareable as possible. If you have questions about accessing your content, contact your Springer Nature Licensing Manager, Christina Sontag. If you have any questions about today's training or basic questions about navigating nature.com, feel free to contact me as well. Thank you.